Hi boys and girls, today we're going to talk about solution to a story. So we talked about the problem in the story. The problem is something that the character has to do or overcome. The solution is how the character solves that problem. Let's look back at this story. We read this story before. It was a beautiful day and John decided to take his dog to the park. Once they were at the park, John stopped to look at the clouds. While John was looking at the clouds, John's dog saw a squirrel. She loves to chase squirrels. She started running after the squirrel. John needs to catch her. So what's the problem in this story? Well, our character is John, our setting's at the park, and our problem is that the dog ran away. Let's keep reading. John chased after his dog, but she was too fast. He couldn't catch her. John stopped and pulled a treat from his pocket. He held up the treat and called his dog. Seeing the treat, she turned around and ran back to John, wagging her tail. What was the solution to this problem? How did John fix the problem that he had that his dog had run away? He took a treat out of his pocket and called his dog, and she came back. So the problem was that the dog ran away, and the solution was that he used a treat and she came back. Now let's try to find the problem and solution in a Scaredy Squirrel book. Scaredy Squirrel never leaves his nut tree. He'd rather stay in his safe and familiar tree than risk venturing out into the unknown. The unknown can be a scary place for a squirrel. So he's perfectly happy to stay right where he is. In Scaredy Squirrel's nut tree, every day is the same, everything is predictable, all is under control. But let's say, just for example, that something unexpected did happen, you can rest assured that this squirrel is prepared. With his emergency kit in hand, Scaredy Squirrel watches day after day, he watches until one day, Thursday at 9.37 a.m., a killer bee appears. Scaredy Squirrel jumps in panic, knocking his emergency kit out of the tree. This was not part of the plan. Scaredy Squirrel jumps to catch his kit. He quickly regrets this idea. The parachute is in the kit. What problem does Scaredy Squirrel have right now? That's right. Scaredy Squirrel fell from his tree and has no parachute. What will he do? Let's keep reading and find out. But something incredible happens, he starts to glide. Scaredy Squirrel is no ordinary squirrel. He is a flying squirrel. He feels overjoyed, adventurous, carefree, alive, until he lands in a bush. Scaredy Squirrel forgets all about the killer bee, not to mention the tarantulas, poison ivy, green martians, germs, and sharks. How did Scaredy Squirrel solve his problem? That's right, because Scaredy Squirrel is a flying squirrel, he doesn't need a parachute. He can glide. Now log back into Seesaw and listen to the end of the dragon story and find the solution.